Hi, welcome to Bouncy Learning Videos. Our topic for today will be on rationalization of certs, which is in both core mathematics and elective mathematics. So I'm going to solve some series of questions, and this will help you know the concept about rationalization. Rationalize the following. So we have a 3 plus root 15, all divided by 4 minus 3 root 5. Then we have b to be 7 plus root 23, all over 3 minus 12 root 3. Then the last one, 4 plus root 2, all divided by 5 plus 2 root 2. So for the first one, first of all, you have to rationalize this by changing the sign here. Let me use a different color. So you change the sign. So when you change the sign, you're going to get positive. So you multiply here by 4 plus 3 root 5 all divided by 4 plus 3 root 5. Okay. So let me remove this. Then, for the multiplication of the denominator side, what you do is to square the first one to 4 squared, which is 16. If there is a negative, still bring it. Because negative times positive still gives negative. So 16 minus, you square this. So squaring 3 will be 9. Squaring with 5 will be 5. Then you multiply the numerator. So you're going to get 12 plus 45 plus 4 15 plus 9. So from here, you do some simplification and you're going to get everything to be 57 plus 4 root 15 plus 9 root 5 all divided by negative 29. So this will be your final answer. So for this one, using the same method, because the sign here is, let me use a different color. The sign here is negative, it will change to positive. So here will be plus, so times 3 plus 12 root 3, all divided by 3 plus 12 root 3. So from here, the, the clue still holds, you square the first which is 9, minus you square 12 which is 144, then you square root 3 which is 3, then you multiply the numerator, you're going to get 21 plus 84 root 3 plus 3 root 23 plus root 69. So after simplifying, you're going to get 21 plus 84 root 3 plus 3 root 23 69. All divided by negative 4, 2, 3. Same one. We are going to change this sign to be negative. Let me use a different color. So we're going to get negative here. So 5 minus 2, 2. All divided by 5 minus 2, 2. So you're multiplying the numerator and the denominator by 
5 minus 2, 2. Do the same trick. You square 5. Since positive times negative is still negative. Minus. Then you square 2, 2. So you square 2 is 4. Squaring root 2 is 2. Then you multiply the numerator. So you're going to get 20 minus 8 root 2 plus 5 root 2 minus 4. So after simplifying, you're going to get 16 minus 3 root 2 all over 17. Don't forget to subscribe. Like, comment, and share. Thank you.